All right, second video addressing all these false ideas that are out there in our fitness culture that can lead you to a lot of unnecessary struggle and maybe even eventual failure. In the last video, I talked about how a lot of big changes in success are a very gradual process for most people. It's not gonna result from a you know, six week challenge or anything like that. Now, the other thing that we want to address is this idea that there's one thing out there that's going to solve all of your problems and be the big game changer for you. And this is the product from a lot of advertising, people uh, advertising their diet or their book or their products and systems and methods and equipment saying, this is gonna be the big game changer for you. And they got the before and after photos and people saying this was the miracle cure I was looking for and stuff. The reality is most people who get a big change in their body do so through a very multifaceted approach. It's never the one thing. And we wanna recognize this because going with a multifaceted approach makes getting much better results a heck of a lot easier. However, trying to put all our eggs in one basket is a lot more stressful and a lot more difficult. For example, let's say that you're trying to lose weight and feel better. And so you're asking your friends and everybody's like, oh, low carb, low sugar, all that sort of thing. So you decide to give that a try cutting back on the carbs, cutting back on processed foods, sugars, and so on, and you start looking and feeling better. You think, this is the ticket, this is what I've been looking for, and you keep cutting these things back. The only problem is you can only restrict your diet to so far. And with every level of restriction, it's getting harder on your mind, harder on your body, harder on your lifestyle, and at the same time, it's a diminishing rate of return. You're starting to agonize over the smallest details for the most minute differences in return. A multifaceted approach says that, okay, we're gonna cut back on some of the unnecessary carbs and processed foods, plus we're gonna drink more water, plus we're gonna have a little more veggies, we'll have veggies with dinner every night, plus we're gonna be more active, I'll go for a walk during my lunch breaks and uh, start doing push-ups when I get home at night. And also start doing a little bit of meditation, downloaded a meditation app, good for the mind, that sort of thing. That multifaceted approach means that you don't have to do anything to any extreme. You can have a better diet, but you don't have to agonize over the amount of sugar and peanut butter. You can still have the occasional treat. You also don't have to become an exercise fanatic or do anything to an extreme in those areas either. You can do a lot of things pretty good and get much better results with a lot less effort than if you try to do one thing as perfect as possible every single day, which is extremely hard to maintain. So use a multifaceted approach to get better results a lot easier. If you like this, please like, share, and subscribe. And uh, as always, be fit and live free.